sugar industry third question study of soils as we learned types of the soils formation of a soils soil erosion everything sorry soil erosion reh gaya par aapne pehle padha hua hai because three classes these were based upon a resource chapter answer it what we call to the study of a soils no options are there so options geology geomorphology pedology hydrology now option options are given yes who will answer first mannat mannat no answer daksh answer term bolo kya thi b d yes you are in a b all are incorrect c option is a correct pedology 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 eighth question सभी तीन आराम से करे थे आगे आ जाओ कम फॉरवर्ड सेट हेयर सेट हेयर सो वेन द टॉप मोस्ट लेयर ऑफ अर्थ क्रस रिमूव बाय द रनिंग वाटर एंड ब्लोइंग विंड इज नोन एज अल इरोजन सो टू अदर एजेंट्स आर देयर एक्सेप्ट दीज टू दू अदर एजेंट्स आर रिस्पॉन्सिबल फॉर द इरोजन लैंड डिग्रेडेशन ऑन अर्थ फॉर एग्जाम्पल फॉर एग्जाम्पल सो देर आर फोर फोर्सेस विच एक्ट ऑन अब द सर्फेस ऑफ द अर्थ क्रस विच लीड टू द erosion of a land land degradation one is a running water second is a blowing wind third is a dash fourth dash complete the blanks third girl yes there are the forces which are act the above the surface of earth crust for land degradation declining the quality of a land resource one as a water second as a wind blowing wind when wind has blowing in a desert areas it carrying the sand and deposited in other areas through which as a sand dunes are formed sand dunes this is as a agent responsible for the soil erosion topmost layer has removed by the blowing wind same as the which another two agents are there responsible for the soil erosion gravitation okay gravitation means that object has moving towards a downward that's why the soil has degraded कोई ऑब्जेक्ट है वो डाउनवर्ड जा रहा है ग्रेविटेशन पार के कारण जा रहा है इस कारण सॉइल इरोजन होता है फिर तो वो होना नहीं चाहिए वी आर हेयर ट्राई टू फाइंड आउट द वेस हाउ टू हाउ टू प्रोटेक्ट द लैंड रिसोर्स फ्रॉम द डिग्रेडेशन फ्रॉम इरोजन फर्स्ट ऑप्शन तो कोई भी नहीं दिया मैंने कहा टू आर टू फोर्सेस आर देयर विंड एंड वॉटर एक्सेप्ट दीज टू वट अदर फोर्सेस एक्ट ऑन सरफेस रिस्पॉन्सिबिट स्टबल मल्चिंग एस टी यू डबल बी एल ई स्टबल मल्चिंग Dutch S T U double B L E mulching. Yes, Akshit. क्या होता है? It is as a methodology used for a conservation of a land resource in a Ganga Brahmaputra plains, where according to the Dutch, the Green Revolution has decreased the fertility of our soils. Nitrogenous content has decreased. we can produce as a leguminous plants but it also needs as a capital investment and most number of the farmers are the poor they are poor anybody else sachem yes ji ha first girl stubble mulching means after the harvesting after harvesting the remains which has appear remains of agriculture crops which has remains in a fields it has mixed in a soils the remains of agriculture crop known as a husk it has mixed in a soils to which the organic matter the material organic matter it will be as a increase dead then decompose parts of plants and animals dead then decompose parts of plants and animals is known as humus jab wo fasal kaatne ke baad jo bachta hai usko soil mein mix kar diya jata hai crush kar diya jata hai through which it decompose and increase the fertility पहले फार्मर्स को प्रॉब्लम होती थी हाउ कैन दे मेंटेन द दैट हस्क ठीक है विच आर नॉट रियरिंग द एनिमल्स किसको दें हम उसका यूज नहीं था सो मोस्ट नंबर ऑफ द फार्मर्स दे बर्नट इट अभी ये स्टार्ट हो जाएगा नेक्स्ट मंथ से अक्टूबर राइस की हार्वेस्टिंग के बाद उसका जो हस्क बचता है उसका मेंटेनेंस नहीं होता था 
Now there are the two of the ways are there. One is a stubble mulching through which the it will mix in the soils through which the soil re, regain their fertility. Second way is there that husk has used for a burning purposes for in a thermal power stations for generation of electricity. Earlier those farmers which burned that husk in the fields, it also killed as a such bacteria which, which were beneficial for the increasing the fertility of our soils like earthworms. Okay? Earthworms. 